A year after a tropical storm swamped her vessel, British adventurer Sarah Alton has overcome her personal demons to continue her man-powered expedition around the globe. She returned to the water to cross the Pacific from Japan to Alaska, and after 150 days at sea, she finally completed the challenge. I was really exhausted when I got to land. The final few weeks were really difficult. Uh, we were making, I was trying to row as much as I possibly could in some quite challenging conditions, and you know, just get in as quickly as possible within a weather window. And particularly the last few days, my whole body was like jelly. The voyage was the latest stage of her 2,000 mile trek around the globe called London to London, using only her body power. Since departing London on April 1st, 2011, the 28 year old has traveled 11,000 miles through Europe, Central Asia, China, Russia, and Japan by kayak, bicycle, and rowing her 21 foot boat. However, the expedition was almost washed away in 2012 when her first effort to cross the North Pacific was halted by Tropical Storm Mawar and forced her to return to London for nine months of training and regrouping. I came back pretty traumatised from what happened. You know, psychologically, um, it, it's quite a massive thing to be in that sort of situation and, and particularly by yourself because there's no one else there that you can relate to, talk to, process it with. Um, and I lost my boat, so it, Sort of, I came home and it all felt very abstract and very huge. It took me a long while to get my head straight again. Alton will now return to the UK to prepare and train for the next stage of her trip, which will begin back on Addock Island. She'll complete her journey back to London with a North Atlantic crossing in 2015.